Hey everybody, welcome back to the Professor's Dugout. I hope you're having a great day. Today's video is a, a summary of a case break that I got into with my LCS Newly Pop Shop for 2021 Top's Finest. I like Top's Finest. It doesn't carry like, you know, a ton of value. Um, you know, honestly, I don't know why. I, I like the look of the cards, but um, it Finest is kind of one of those cool sets. You know, historically, it is the the originator of the refractor. So, um, so I usually try to get usually try to buy a couple boxes of this, but you know, boxes have been running like two twenty, two thirty. So I, I I've just gotten into breaks, um, figuring that that wouldn't be so bad. I could grab a f several teams and just just have some fun. So I picked a bunch of uh, more value-driven teams for this case break. I, I actually grabbed six um, since they needed a little help filling, but that wasn't too bad. So I grabbed the Indians, the Brewers, uh, the Toronto Blue Jays, the Kansas City Royals, uh, Houston Astros, and the Texas Rangers. So let's go ahead. Let's see how I did. Uh, first for the... Indians, uh, no auto in that, but a lot of Tristan McKenzie rookies, uh, a couple Shane Bieber's, Andreas Jimenez, uh, and I did get, uh, at least I got some re a couple of refractors for Shane Bieber and Tristan McKenzie. Um, let's see, what should we do next? We will do, let's do the Royals. Royals don't have a lot of base cards. It's really just with M Merrifield. I was hoping to get a get a uh, uh, Brady Singer auto. I did not, but I did get a Chris Bubik, and he's been pretty solid. Uh, he's been looking pretty good, so that might be kind of a nice little hold. Let's see how he works out for the next couple of years. Um, let's see. Let's go I'll do the Brewers. Uh, for the Brewers, Jackie Bradley, Junior, and Christian Yelich are the our base cards in the checklist. We did get this Legacies with Christian Yelich and Robin Yount. Uh, like that card. That's a nice looking card. I did get a, I think this is called the Blue and Aqua Vapor or something like that. Um, for Jackie Bradley Jr. That is numbered out of 250. And I actually got the case, one of the case hits. And this case hit is um, the what is it called? The Ketsukori. Um Parallel. This is the black gold parallel. You can kind of see it's got sort of that cracked um, look where, it, where, where they've kind of fixed, you know, pottery by using uh, gold as the glue. It's kind of, I really like this design. It's one of my, that's kind of a really cool insert so um that's really cool i really like that card i'm uh, gonna hold on to it for a little while um for the houston astros they have a, a number of car you know vets in the base we did get you know some your jordan alvarez um, they also have some number of players in the short prints as well uh, short prints are numbered uh, like 101 to 125. I think you only get like one per box. Um, but we did get a refractor for Zach Greinke. Um, an aqua or green shimmer. I think that's aqua shimmer for uh, Jose Altuve. Um, green speckle out of 125 for Jordan Alvarez. And we did get an auto, a gold auto for Anole Paredes. Uh, that is number two out of 50. Uh, nice on-card auto there. Uh, for the Blue Jays, I think the Blue Jays are a good value. You know, they, you know, a good value pickup. They've got a couple interesting rookies with Nate Pearson and Christian Kirk. And then you can still get some autos for Vlad Jr. And so there's some interesting stuff. You know, Bo Bichette. Uh, legacies with uh, Vlad Jr. 
you know, Bo Bichette, Alejandro Kirk, uh, rookie card. I think he's in Series 2, Top Series 2, which um, just came out as well. There's a Bo Bichette refractor, Nate Pearson refractor, Vlad Guerrero Jr. refractor, Marcus Simeon refractor, um, base Pearson. We did get a sky blue for George Springer. That is numbered out of 300. A Nate Pearson. It's like that aqua vapor. Um, that's numbered out of 250. And we got a really cool Alejandro Kirk red. Numbered five of five. Fortunately, no, that's on the that's on the sleeve. For so I can maybe clean that off. Maybe clean that off. Yeah, there it goes. Okay, so really nice looking card. Numbered five out of five. Um, so. That was really cool to, to get. So no auto, but I'll take a I'll take a super low numbered rookie card over a base auto almost any day of the week. And then finally for Texas, Joey Gallo and, and Sam Huff are pretty much your base cards. You know, getting some of those Sam Sam Huff rookie cards, not so bad. Uh, I did get a blue Joey Gallo out of 150. I did get three autos, one for Anderson Tejeda, uh, Nick Solak, and Leody Tavares. So um, for, you know, a cheaper team, getting three autos out of that, not, not so bad. That's kind of, I consider that a, a victory. But, you know, we did get no big autos, unfortunately. We did get the one gold, but, you know, got a couple really nice parallels, and, um Last year, you were lucky to get, like, you know, you would get one or two parallels per, per mini box. Now you get, like, three or four per, per mini box. They have expanded sort of the rainbow that you can get, but that's that's uh, that's pretty nice. I really like the, uh, the look this year. What do you think about 2021 Finest? Go ahead, leave a comment below, smash that like and subscribe button. Thanks for watching, everybody. Continue to stay safe out there. And I will see you later.